the senior for the Longhorns. Successfully clears 171. Men's 200 about to get underway in the first of two sections. In the top left of your screen there, you're going to hear celebrations at various moments. That time is the men's high jump. One of our four events on your screen here on Big 12 now. It's one of the advantages of having been on your home track. You get the loudest cheers. That was for Caleb Wilborn. Men's 200 underway, again, first of two sections. Moss for Texas, Makita and Mariengo for TCU, and Shelton for Texas Tech. And it looks like Shelton of Texas Tech, who we saw win earlier today, just dropped out. It looked like he grabbed his hamstring right after the start. It'll be Mariengo, the senior, who sets the standard at 20.77. Will that hold up for the purple to take gold? Ooh, yeah, you see that replay, you see Shelton grab his hamstring, you hate to see that, but Matty Yenga and Maketa going 1-2 down the home straight. 20-77 will be the time to watch for section two. Matty Yenga, that was just .02 off of that Zimbabwe indoor record he set here in Lubbock earlier this month. Lubbock is an ideal location for these sprint events. Uh, the facility is just over 3,000 feet of elevation, which gives the sprint events a little bit of a performance boost while making the distance events a little bit harder. Alyssa Miller able to clear on her first try the height of 171. She becomes the sixth woman to do so. It's the third height today for the women. She's the sister of Aaliyah Miller, who we saw notably win the 800 for the women earlier today. The nice thing about raising kids like that is uh, you're out there on the track and you have a general idea of where, where they're going to be. Whether they're just running in circles, yeah. they'll, they'll always come back around to you, or in her case, just jumping over, I guess, high objects. A little more daunting if it's in the house. Again, men's 200 meters top left, men's high jump top right, the women, bottom left, and the shot put in the bottom right. The. Hey, TCU girl. Time to beat 20.77 from Marienga in that first section. For the 200. Jillian Johnson, the sophomore for TCU, on her first attempt on 1.71 meters. Five feet seven and a quarter. We'll get two more tries. A set of Trinity Tomlinson, a Texas freshman. The next woman up. In a moment, we'll hear the starter's pistol for the back half here of the men's 200. Two Longhorns, Caleb Holbin, freshman, Makai Harris, the senior. Horn Frog and Sooner sprinkled into the mix as well. And Makai Harris of Texas is the defending champion in this event. And he's off to a strong start. That's Makaya Harris. And Makaya Harris running his own race, your Big 12 champion in the 200, outclassing the rest of the field. 20:38, final time, fastest time in the Big 12 this year. Marius Smith will take silver. Anyanga able to hang on for bronze and has three horn frogs occupy the top five. And congratulations to the Longhorn senior, Kaya Harris. The 
is his best as a Longhorn and again the best showing by a Big 12 performer this year. That's uh, also a Texas school record. The previous Texas record was 20.4. Those are not easy to come by anymore. Impressive run for Micaiah Harris. So on the men's side, those are valuable points for Harris. It pulls Texas within seven of Texas Tech. That time's also the second fastest in the NCAA this year. <laughs> 